what is going on, guys? It, I just watched uh, the seventh episode of Santa Clarita Diet titled uh, Strange or Just Inconsiderate. And it basically comes from the scene where uh, the, the, the police officer stops by and to talk about Stan, Dan's uh, strange disappearance all of a sudden. And it's like, if you're the neighbors and you're the friend, then why why don't you visit 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 uh, his wife? Is that strange or just inconsiderate? You know, so the the beginning of the episode starts off with uh, Shelia talking to her friend just about basically unda uh, boring, mundane, usual things that happen in her life. Kind of like, well, this is stressing me out. That's stressing me out. I live a very stressful life. And it's like, what about you? And then she begins to talk. It's like, oh, I lost a pen and whatever. And it's just so funny because she's talking about like uh, being on the beach and being out that cloud. And as soon as she, her friends start talking about uh, a college and shit, like uh, uh, she sees um, uh, Joel uh, throwing throwing Dan's dead body over the fence, and all of a sudden she's like, "Fuck, in kites! I just love fucking kites!" And and it's like seems so overly enthusiastic about kites, and she's like, "Wow, you're really uh, you know enthusiastic about kites. Well, good for you." And she's like, "Yes, I am, but you have to go. Oh, why do I have to go? Well, just do, you know." Uh, you know, it's kind of just like what I was saying. Uh, uh, like the comedy is just kind of like it—it it, it just really slapstick and just like uh, weird shit that happen. So, so um, the next thing that happens is like um, they're kind of like figuring it out, like what the hell is like. And then she's like, "Well, you remember how you're telling us we need to think about our decisions and everything? You're 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 so sweet and you're so kind, you're so gallant." And it's like she 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 goes into uh, uh, um uh criticizing him is like <clears throat> oh but you're so sweet you're so gallant you think of everybody and um so 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 after that he just kind of like like just i guess kind of fed up with it or just kind of like just tired of everything and he's like let's go get some coffee do you ever think about beans be i mean coffee coffee is just basically like bring bean that you drink you know um so, so they're just kind of like arguing, and it's just she's just like, you really want to talk about my decision making in front of the neighbor that you just killed with a shovel, you know? And then um, so 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 the police officer from the next door comes in and it's like, like oh, what were y'all two doing? And they both answer at the same time, but one of them answers sex and the other answers fighting, and it's like, you know, um, so. You know, it's it's like I'm trying something new, like you know, like just write down the the what I thought of the episode as the episode's going on. But I don't know, I'm just kind of like just talking about the episode in general. I think I could try this, but I don't know. It just feels kind of weird. Maybe I'll just put it down and just riff riff it off of what I what just general remember what I could remember about the episode, I guess. Or I'll just use this. So might as well still have it. Um. So anyway, so yeah, this this episode is just kind of like, um, you know, Dan's first kill because of the heat of the moment kind of thing, and then and then just um, Dan's uh, stepson is just kind of like, like he feels kind of at ease with it because he wanted like in the in the previous episode he just wanted to get even with his with his stepfather because he's been uh, on his ass for like you know just making fun of him and shit. It's just like okay, well how am I gonna get to him and then. Joel basically kills him, and it's like, well, you can stop it, you know, <laughs> I mean, a little kind of already right there, but it's kind of funny, because it's like, when he's talking to to the girl, uh, I kind of forgot her name, but when he's talking to the girl, he's like, like, well, I'm gonna tell her, like, I'm gonna confront him, and I said, you can stop it, you know, <laughs> it's like, whoa, that's a little bit extreme, you shouldn't really do that, because bullies might just kick your ass, and, you know, but, um, so, yeah, so so basically throughout this episode, it's kind of, just kind of like it, earlier on, it's like uh, you know when when Sheila killed someone, it's basically on her head, and now it's like oh sh oh shit, what did I do? I accidentally bought up the menu. I don't know how. Uh, so yeah, it's just kind of like like the roles is kind of reversed, and since since the uh, the last three episodes of the first season, you know things like are getting too spicy for pepper, and it's, it's a lot of crazy situations going on. Uh, that's basically pretty much what I have uh, for this episode. Uh, you know, to do this, it's like, um, man, I can't wait. I can't wait. I honest, can't wait to see how uh, uh, this season ends and what the hell happens or whatever. 
or you know what season two is gonna bring. And actually, I saw like uh, I looked it up uh, earlier today. This is kind of irrelevant a little bit, but um, I know that Kimmy Schmidt is coming back on the oh, third season. Like I forgot, it was, I think it's on the May sixteenth or seventeenth or whatever. And then like two days before that, um, I don't know if that's right exactly, but whatever. Uh, two days before that is the return of uh, of uh, Master of None, and uh, actually, cause. I was thinking, well, when the hell is that, that show going to come out? Uh, like, because the last time, like, uh, I seen, like, you know, the, the first season came out was it two, two years ago, about two years ago. But Master of None, that's just a hysterical show. If you haven't seen it, I mean, it, it stars a, a, a Aziz Ansari from uh, uh, um, Parks and Recreations. And, and just the first uh, uh, scene alone, it's just hysterical because it's like, just kind of like everybody's been in that situation when you're with someone and then... You, you feel like that thing breaks and you're just kind of like freaking the hell out and like, what to do next. And it's funny because uh, when I was watching that, that that first episode, I was in the gym and it was kind of like like not that many people were there. And in that first scene, I just started laughing out loud. I laughed so ha I laughed so loud, I could hear myself through the headphones. And like beyond the headphones, I could hear echoes of my laughter. And I was like, oh, shit, did anybody else hear? And if any did, well. Doesn't matter because I laugh. You know, it it feels kind of funny though because like uh, when I'm at a gym, it feels like everybody's serious about the workout and shit. I mean, you should, right? But when I hear something funny on a podcast, I just start laughing or disagreeing, whatever. And it's kind of funny because like I said, like it's rarely people. It's rare that that people laugh in the gym, but it's like I'm just one of those people. Like I don't really care. I, if I thought it was funny, I'll just start laughing at it. So anyway, I got off side trap, and I was bit with my review of uh of um that show that I'm talking about Santa Clarita Diet I don't know if I'm gonna keep writing it down or just kind of like talk about whatever I remember from the show I think I'm just gonna talk about what I show because the list is kind of distracting to be honest anyway um oh what I'm uh, next next is um I'm gonna watch uh um Shit, what am I going to watch? What drop today? Uh, Iron Fist. Yeah, Iron Fist. I'm going to watch that. And obviously, I'm going to come back here, talk about it. And that's basically the end of it. And before I go, I just want to have a special shout out to to uh, all my subscribers. You know, everybody that watched my videos. And one particular, uh, my dad. You know, he watched all my videos. You know, he liked everything I put out. And yeah, special uh, shout out to everybody that, that support my channel and watch all my videos. You're, you're, you're great. You're awesome. Winner in my book. Anyway, that's the end of this video. I'm out like the flash and see you with another video.